Hey everyone, my name is Mike Mello and welcome to the Luxury Home Channel here on YouTube. Today we're in Palm Beach Gardens, which is over by Boca Raton on the east coast of Florida. We're in a community called Artistry, which is by Coulter Homes. They also have a community on the west coast in Sarasota that we've also filmed. So check out our actual page for that as well. So we're going to be showing you this home behind me. It's a Michelangelo. They're all about different famous artists. And this home here is a three bedroom, three full bath, one half bath home with 2,984 square feet of living. The actual base price at time of filming, and we are in August of 2022, is going to be $1,564,990. Now that is the base price, does not include lot premiums, does not include upgrades, and this home has a ton of upgrades, so please keep that in mind when we take a tour of this home. So let's go ahead and take a tour, but as we come up here, of course, we have the nice paved driveway coming up to this home. The home itself has a three-car garage. It's got a two-car garage here in front of me with the two carriage lights on either side, and then over here on the left is another one-car garage with the two carriage lights. We do have the tile roof as well as we come up to the front entry of the home. One thing that I do want to point out is that this single car garage does have a door here. So this is where you get in and out of the actual garage. They don't have an interior door. I'm sure you could probably put one in if you wanted to. And then we come over here and we do step up into the front entryway. And of course the front entryway has these double French doors. And of course the windows above us are plenty of natural light. So let's go ahead and go inside and check out this home. All right, so welcome into this single story home. And this has to be one of the most luxurious single story homes I've actually seen myself. As I come in, the first thing I notice, of course, are these tiles. And I love how they have this design where they have the arrows going in and they sort of meet right here in the center on the different directions on the actual uh, triangle shapes going in and out. So as I come in here, of course, the first thing I go to see is gonna be over here to my right, which is this accent wall. They have this beautiful tile work going all the way up. And of course, all the wood framing going around, all painted in white. And then over here, here we sort of have an antique mirror look going up as well, which is very beautiful. And then these are very, very tall ceilings. As you look up, you can see that they go up probably about 15 plus feet. And then of course we do have the tray ceiling with the wood design in the actual center and this beautiful chandelier hanging down. And of course these little cool designs going on either side of the tray ceilings as well. And you'll see that also in the family room. Now, before we go anywhere, we're we'll gonna go ahead and go back this direction and see bedroom number two. So as we come through here, this area here is just storage. They have some pretty cool wood shelves going through for all your storage goods there. And then we come into the secondary bedroom suite. This has currently got a queen size bed in it. We have a nice end table on that side. So as you can see, plenty of space here. And of course we have an accent wall with all the woodworking and the woodworking goes all the way up the wall. And then of course across the ceiling as well, very tall ceilings. And then it comes across onto the other side of the wall as well. So very, very high end as far as the actual walls go here. And then we come this direction here. This is an ensuite, So you have your own bathroom. So as you come through here, we have this really nice gloss tile floor. And of course the countertop and then the cabinets sink. We have the mirror that goes all the way up to the ceiling. Really cool LED light fixture there. And of course we have our toilet and tub. And then we have subway tile going all the way up to the ceiling. And of course this beautiful design in the tub area as well. Now on the other side, we do have a walk-in closet. As we go over here, you can see we do have that closet here for all your clothes, so plenty of space there as well. So let's continue the tour and go this direction. Um, and as we go through, we go past this really high-end carpet back onto that tile floor. And then as I come this direction, I'm gonna ask Haley, who's filming today, to go over here so that you can actually see what you see when you come into the door. So it's just by the door. This is the actual um, view that you'll get as you open up the door. Not only do you get that family room and you see the ceilings there and all those architectural designs, but over here to my right, they've done something different here. This would be bedroom number three typically, uh, and bedroom number three would have its own ensuite as well, so you'd have your own bathroom, but they've changed this into an actual office, and I love this office. I think this is really cool. I like the colors of the walls, and of course we have the cabinets, and we have these grays on the cabinets, and we do have the waterfall edge with these really nice countertops that have all these little silver shiny things in it as well, which is really cool, and of course the woodwork going up with these floating shelves going all the way through for all, all your different uh, uh, accents as far as decor and stuff goes. And of course, in the middle, we do have an actual desk that looks like a wing of an airplane and of course a chair. And then we have the window for some natural light. And then on the other side, we see that we do have that same sort of cabinet that we see on that side as well. Now, as I look up, we do have the tray ceiling with some nice woodworking and of course, wallpaper in there with the recessed lights. And it's a really cool light fixture that hangs from the center. And then what's really neat is over here, we have our own little uh, wine uh, closet. So as we open this up here, you can go in and as you can see, um, plenty of space for wine 
Each of these can have two bottles on it. You go all the way up on that side, also on that side, mirror on either side, which is really cool. And there's really nice wallpaper in the center as well, and mirrors on your side there as well. So that is all pretty darn cool. So let me go ahead and close that. And then follow me. What we'll do is go right across the hallway here and take you over here. So as I come over this direction, this door goes into the garage. Currently they're using it for storage, so we won't go in there, but we come into the laundry room. So we have plenty of cabinets here. Also the solid surface countertops. We have our washer, dryer, and plenty of cabinets. And then the backsplash is actually tile. It looks like glass tile going all the way up to the ceiling. So that's really neat. And as I come up here on the other side of the garage, we have a little drop zone, nice cabinets, same sort of countertops that we saw in the office. And of course we do have a cabinet above it as well. And then we do have our half bath. So as we come into the half bath, we have our pedestal sink, nice mirror, of course the toilet, and then they've done the walls with a cool paint job on the stripes going all the way up to the ceiling. So let's go ahead and follow me this direction. As I go right, you'll come into the main living area. So as we come in here, you'll see family room, kitchen, and we have what's called the club room, which Coulter is known for doing. A few of their models have this club room. So let's go ahead into the club room and show you what we have going on over here. So this is like another little hangout area. You sit and couch, you can have some conversations, you can watch some TV, you can play some games, do whatever you want. But of course, like all the other rooms, all the different upgrades and the designs that they have here are amazing. They have the woodwork in sort of like a bluish gray color going all the way out with a crown molding. And of course there's beige tile inserts and that wall there matches this, this side of the wall as well. So you have it on both sides. And of course we do have the tall ceilings. That's tray with the crown molding and also this really cool tile work with it looks like old uh, like broken tile and, and triangle shapes up there. And then over on this side, we even have these built-in shelves, nice thick glass shelves. And then we even have a little cabinet down here where you can store some stuff as well, a little wine area. So, and then as we continue to go here, go into the family room, here is the family room, which is really cool as well. Um, we do have our little area here where you have your TV. They have it all tiled up as well. So you can put the, the TV on the tile and of course the nice architectural accent wall. It goes all the way up to the ceiling. And then this ceiling matches the actual ceiling that we saw in the entryway where it has all the different architectural fe uh, uh, features with these other features that pop down and of course all the woodworking and then the, the actual uh, wood planks to go in the center as well. Uh, pretty neat. And then this really cool light fixture comes down the center. So uh, really like just really cool upgrades throughout. So as we come over here, we start into the kitchen. So the kitchen starts right here. And of course we have plenty of drawers. You know, everything's gonna be high quality and soft clothes. And of course the countertops. And then we do have the backsplash as well. And the cabinets that go all the way up. And then they do have the frosted glass on the top with LED lights in to put all your fine china in. And then the next stop would be your actual refrigerator. So it is a monogram refrigerator, all nice high-end refrigerator, freezer area. And then we do have cabinet space above it as well. Then over here would be the actual pantry. So we open up this here and we go into the pantry. As you can see, you have plenty of space for all your dry goods. And then, uh, then the kitchen continues with plenty of storage down here. Then we have a monogram oven. And then we also have the microwave convection oven as well. Um, and then of course, all the extra storage as we continue to go. And we see that frosted glass going all the way along the top of the kitchen as well. And then on this side as well, we do see we do have all the extra cabinets. We do have a, a five burner, or six burner, five burner gas stove top. And then of course the monogram air vent that vents all the aromas out. And then all this on this side, we're gonna see we're gonna have dark brown, but then on the center island, if I talk about the center island, we have white cabinets. Not only do we have white cabinets, we do have the same countertop, but that countertop is a waterfall countertop because it goes over the side all the way down to the floor, which is really cool. So we have our dishwasher, we have our sink, it's a Moen sink and also faucet. We have these really cool three pendant lights that come down. And of course we have seating for five. So if you wanted to have breakfast down here on your center island, which is relatively large, you can do so. And of course the cabinets continue to go all the way down. Um, and then of course you have your uh, trash drawer right there as well, which is really neat. So, and then of course behind me is gonna be your breakfast nook, which is really cool, or your dining room. So as we come through here, it's currently set up for eight people. Um, and what's neat about this one here is that we also have an accent wall over on the far side as well with lots of woodworking. And of course that built-in mirror and of course the window for some natural light. And it goes up and of course above us, we have a nice ceiling. The ceiling is also a tray ceiling with lots of crown molding. 
and also a wallpaper with these two light fixtures that pop down from the, from the ceiling as well. Of course, we have our window looking out in our summer kitchen and also a pool. We'll show you that in just a second because that's out through here. And the outdoor living area is amazing here. We have a fireplace, we have a summer kitchen, and we have a really amazing pool that I can't wait to go and walk across. So I'll show you that in a second. But let's go ahead and come into our primary bedroom suite as we come through here where there's really cool wallpaper as we come into the entrance to the primary bedroom suite. Uh, we switch from the actual tile floor to wood floor as we come into this. And then of course we see we have a king size bed. We have end tables on either side. We have that antique mirror look that we saw in the front entryway. We had that behind the headboard and of course all the woodworking behind that as well. That woodworking that's behind the headboard also matches the ceiling and goes around the tray ceiling with a couple different layers. And of course this light fixture that drops down from the ceiling as well. And of course we have the windows. Window here looks out in the pool. And of course the windows here look out on the tropical landscaping. So let's go ahead and check out the actual uh, bathroom. So follow me this direction and we'll show you the bathroom. So we do have our linen closet and then from the linen closet, we have our sink area. So we have all these cabinets, beautiful colors. And of course the countertop, we do have a Moen sink and faucet. And we have two of them on your side. We have the mirror, but then we also have tile that goes all the way up to the ceiling. And these three light fixtures that are trios of light fixtures hanging down as well over this really cool uh, bush that's in the middle of your countertop. Now on the other side, we do have a water closet and then we do have the tub. The tub is uh, surrounded by this beautiful tile as well. And then of course the shower, a frameless shower as you enter in. And of course the tile on there matches the tile around the tub. And then we also have a window up there for some natural light as well. And then we go into the actual closet. So go back into the um, wood flooring. And of course this is all custom closets, all set up to put all the clothes that you need all the way around. Nice cabinet work, as you can see, going all the way through and plenty of mirrors. So we have a mirror on this side too, <laughs> that Haley might have just got caught on. Uh, so you have a mirror there and then a mirror over here um, and then even more space on this side as well for uh, your clothes. So let's go ahead and go out and uh, Haley does her best not to get on camera, but she might have got caught there. Uh, if you haven't done already, make sure you like and subscribe. We definitely appreciate it as we travel throughout the Southeast and nation and film these luxury homes. We definitely appreciate that. If you're looking to buy a home, it doesn't have to be a luxury home. If you're looking to buy a home in Florida, make sure you give me a call at 407-487-3030. With that being said, I think the best part is the outdoor living. So let's go ahead out there and show you the outdoor living space. All right, so here we are on the outdoor living. Of course, we have this beautiful tile as soon as we walk out. And then we're welcomed by our outdoor living area. The living area itself is set up with a couch, a couple chairs. And of course, we have a fireplace with the ceramic tile that goes all the way up to the ceiling. And they've done like grays on either side as well that contrasts really well with the beige colors. Now, as we continue to tour, of course, we'll see the pool. We'll show you that in just a second. But we have the uh, dining area. So outdoor dining currently set up for six people. And then we have our summer kitchen. The summer kitchen consists of a refrigerator, plenty of storage, and of course the barbecue you can sit out here and barbecue. And then of course it continues out through here. And we do have a wall going all the way around this outdoor living area with of course the tropical landscaping throughout. And then we do have the pool. So the pool has this little device here. I'm not too sure what it is. I think this is a, one of those ones where you can do laps, where it gives you current and you can swim and do laps in it. Uh, so I believe that's what that's for. And of course you have this beautiful tile work going all the way throughout here. These will be fountains. Hopefully they won't turn on as I walk across here. But as you can see, you can walk across and jump in. The kids will probably have a great time here. And we have this wall here as well with the elevated bushes behind me. And of course the tropical landscaping. So that's this home. I wanna thank everyone for watching and I'll talk to you all next time. Take care, bye-bye.